Edexcel A-Level Maths, Pure Paper 2, Summer 2018, Question 2. So we're told that the point A has position vector 2i plus 3j minus 4k. The point B has position vector 4i minus 2j plus 3k. And the point C has position vector ai plus 5j minus 2k where a is a constant smaller than zero. We're also told that d is the point such that the vector a to b is equal to the vector b to d. So we want to find the position vector of d. Well, that's going to be equal to o d, and by our rules of adding together vectors, we know that o d must be the same as o b plus b d. Our question tells us that b d is equal to a b, so we can replace that and AB must be equal to OB minus OA, again by our rules of vectors. Now we know what OB and OA are from our question, so we can put them in. OB is 4 minus 2, 3. A is 2, 3 minus 4. Bringing them together, completing the sum, gives us OD equal to 6 minus 7 and 10. We now want to find the value of A when given the fact that the magnitude of AC is equal to 4. Now we can calculate the magnitude of a vector by using Pythagoras' theorem. So first of all we're going to do that using our position vectors C and A. So the magnitude of AC must be equal to the square root of A minus 2 all squared, where the A is the I part of C and the 2 is the I part of A and the similar things for the rest, so plus the difference between 5 and 3 squared, plus the difference between minus 2 and minus 4, all squared. And we also know that the magnitude of AC is equal to 4, we're given that in the question, so replacing the AC with 4 and simplifying the right hand side gives us that 4 is equal to the square root of A minus 2 all squared plus 4 plus 4, the right hand side, those 4's come together to give us an 8. Squaring both sides gives us that 16 is equal to a minus 2 all squared plus 8. So a minus 2 all squared must equal 8. a minus 2 equals plus or minus 2 root 2 by square rooting both sides. So a is equal to 2 plus or minus 2 root 2 but we're told in the question that a is smaller than zero, hence it can't be two plus two root two, so a must be equal to two minus two root two. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to the Doing Maths channel or check out some more of my videos by clicking on the links here.